It's unusually quiet outside Jomo Kenyatta Airport in Nairobi. It's the main hub for Kenya Airways, whose pilots have been on strike since Saturday, leaving thousands of passengers stranded. They began their industrial action despite a court suspension order after the Kenya Pilots Association said it had failed to reach an agreement with management on better working conditions. While some people have found alternative flights, others have not been so lucky. I'm feeling very sad and heartbroken to see all this is happening. People are striking and the government of Kenya are doing nothing about it to make sure that the people are going back to their homes. There are people who have work to do and now we are stuck here. Like four days is a long time. On Monday, the airline was forced to cancel 75% of its flights. Some passengers have expressed their disappointment as alternative routes offered by the airline add many hours to their journeys. I'm here because I was supposed to go home today from Nairobi to Lagos, um, which, uh, but like due to the strike, they've postponed our flights um, to 4.30 a.m. tomorrow. <laughs> now I need to think about like what I'm going to do tonight and um, also like the plans that I made back at home. The strike is exacerbating the woes of the troubled national carrier, which has been running at a loss for years, despite the government pumping in millions of dollars to keep it afloat.